welcome to my channel so we get the power one if you find that this video resonate with you please hit the like button please comment down below subscribe to my channel hit the notification bell so you never miss out on any of my uploads we're going to hop right into it and say share the cards and shuffle over the decks if you're looking for a personal reading everything is listed down below in the description box as well we're going to hop right into it we're going to be seeing what's going on with your current situation what's going on with the current energy you know we're going to focus on energy this is going to be a quick reading as well Thank you so much for watching. Comment down below. Subscribing. What's going on with my Power 1 current situation? Also take what resonates and leave what doesn't. What's going on with my Power 1 current situation? What's going on with my Power 1 current situation? We can't, can't get you off my mind. We got online. So for some of you, somebody's watching you online. For some of you guys, this is somebody that can't get you off of their mind. For some of you guys, we got shade, shady jokes, but I don't like it. So for some of you, whoever this person is, this could be somebody that's watching you online. For some of y'all, this can be somebody that can't get you off of your mind. This is somebody that doesn't like you. For some of y'all, you could be embedded in this person's brain. For some of y'all, whoever this person is that's watching you online, for some of you guys, uh, this person could like to say shady when Marcy or like to say slick things in a joke. Or for some of y'all, that's not the case. For some of y'all, this is somebody that you could have messed around with or you could have dated. This person's watching you online. You and this person used to say, used to um, be very playful with one another. Used to say playful jokes to one another. This is who this person is. For some of you guys, they're watching you. We got a group event. For some of you guys, you could have went out in a group event. For some of you guys, you was out in a group event. For some, for some of you guys, you could have been out and went to a group event. For some of you guys, and somebody could have been saying shady remarks or, or shady jokes for some of you guys or something like that. We got friends on. So for some of y'all, you could have friends on somebody for some of you guys. And somebody could have got upset upset about that. Not for everyone, but for some of you, you could have friends on someone that got upset about that. For some of y'all, somebody could have been out at a group. And, for some of y'all, could have went out to a group event and somebody could have liked you for some of you guys. And they can't get you off their mind ever since. For some of y'all, this person could be a friend. Or, this, or for some of you guys. For some of y'all, this person could have joked around you, but this person could really like you for some of you guys. Take what resonates I'm getting all types of messages. We got flexing. Flex and don't really have it so for some of you guys um this person can um be flexing but really doesn't have it for some of you guys and you could have friends on them but whoever this person is they're watching you online so this could give you an idea of who this person is for some of you guys we got ex partners so for some of y'all yeah for some of y'all this is somebody that you could have messed around with that you could have dated for some of you guys this is somebody that you could have friend zone you could have messed with this person and not and you could have just friend zone and you just decided you didn't want you maybe y'all could just be friends or you just decided you you know you got what to go be nothing for some of you guys or for some of y'all this could be an ex partner for some of you guys they could be saying shady little jokes to you or remarks to you because you could have decided to go out for some of you guys for some of y'all they could can't get this off this mind for some of you guys so they could be insecure for some of you guys y'all could look better and start dressing better some of y'all you look insecure i mean they feel insecure for some of y'all ex parts that could have tried to make you feel insecure for some of you guys um for some of you guys just somebody that flex like they have it when they really don't but for some of y'all i'm also getting to some of y'all somebody could have liked you y'all could have went out in a group event with somebody and you could have friends on them for some of y'all the person could have had pure intentions but you friends on them because maybe you wasn't feeling them or maybe you weren't trusted to them for some of you guys but this is who this person is. So now we're going to get into it and see. Let's go. For some, whoever this person is, or they can feel like you, they, um, people, this, um, we got, I don't trust you. So for some of you, whoever this person is, they cannot trust you or you don't trust this person for some of you guys. Or for some of you guys, for some of you guys, you can have pure attention for some of you guys and somebody doesn't trust you. You could have pure attention. Some of y'all could have went out to a group event or something. Somebody could have been saying shady marks or something towards you because they don't like you or they just don't trust you. They could have had an iffy feeling about you, but you had pure attention from the jump. For some of you guys, for some of you guys, this person can feel like you you get away with things or people or, or people let you slide or get away with things. For some of y'all, or this person, for some of y'all, this person could like to say slay this, uh, like to say a uh, slay joke for some of you guys and try to get away with it. Uh, we got if you if you know the truth. We will be over. I don't want this. So some of y'all, you could have dated somebody for some of y'all. And they feel like if you know the truth, you and this person will be over for some of y'all. Yeah, we got I don't trust you. Some of y'all, this ex-partner for some of y'all, whoever this person that you're dating. you If you know the truth about what they're doing for some of you guys. And you wouldn't want to be with them anymore. This is how they feel. We got right person, wrong time. For some of y'all, this person could feel like 
yeah, for some of y'all, this person could feel like a right person, wrong time. So for some of y'all, could have dated somebody for some of you guys, and and it could just been a um, right person, but wrong time. Or this person could have felt like you were the, you were the right person, but you met them at the wrong time. For some of you guys, for some of you guys, this person feel like if they would have told you the truth, you would have walked away from them, so they could have lied and kept or kept certain things hidden from you. You cannot trust this person, and this um person can have abandonment issues for some of you guys. So this person can uh, uh fear people losing somebody. Got to be very codependent from you guys, or for some of you, or you could be codependent on this person. We got to do clown shit to embarrass motherfuckers. So this person could have been immature. Somebody that could have just been doing stuff, or this person could have been embarrassing you guys. For some of you, you then this person could have been embarrassing you, or just have you out here looking stupid behind your back. Um, I say stuff to get under your skin because I want a reaction. So some of y'all, this person, you and this person could have got an argument. This person could have say certain stuff to get a reaction out of you for some of you guys. Um, this person could, for some of y'all, this person could have always said that you were too sensitive for some of you guys because they just didn't want to, uh, uh, want to, uh, care about the truth for some of you guys. This person don't like caring about the truth. This person could be a narcissist for some of y'all, not for all. But for some of y'all, this person does not like hearing the truth for some of you guys. And this person could say stuff to get under your skin. For some of y'all, if you call this person now, they could get upset. For some of y'all, we got, I manipulate, uh, manipulate, because that's the only way I feel I can get my way. For some of y'all, this person could be very manipulative. They could feel like they have to manipulate people to get their way, or they, or could be very manipulated to where they want things to go their way, so they manipulate other people. Give me some more insight on this situation. We got wonder if you moved on so for some of you guys this person's wondering if you moved on for some of you guys for some of you guys this could be friends old friends wonder if you moved on wonder if you found a new friend are you hanging out with somebody else for some of you guys this could be somebody again that you friend zone for some of you guys that you could have been friends but you friend zone them for some of you guys they wonder if you moved on if you started talking to somebody else um, for some of you guys, we have multiple lovers. So for some of you guys, this person could have multiple lovers. Or for some of y'all, this person is wondering, wonder if you moved on. This person could want to know if you have multiple lovers. For some of you, this could be somebody that had multiple lovers worried about if you moved on from them. We have want your partner. So for some of y'all, there could be some, for some of y'all, we got friends. For some of y'all, there could be a friend around you that could want your partner. For some of you, not for everyone, but it could be a friend. Yeah, for some of you, you could have a friend around you that sister and say slight funny jokes or say little hidden jokes or, or talk like, say little slick shit in the joke. For some of you guys, this friend could secretly want your partner. For some of you guys, we got single as fuck, no hoes. For some of you guys, this friend could be a, a hoe themselves for some of you guys. Or this could be a coworker for some of you guys. Um... For some of y'all, we got boss and coworker for some of you guys. So this could be a coworker friend that you with for some of you guys. This person could secretly want your partner for some of you guys. Or for some of y'all, your coworkers, or some of y'all, somebody could be messing with a boss for some of you guys. A coworker can, can be messing with a boss for some of you guys. Or this person could be a boss that you're messing with or in some boss position for some of you guys. One more one more card we got abortion so some of you guys a co-worker or someone could have had an abortion or a boss could have had an abortion for some of you guys this person could have had multiple lovers and could have got pregnant had an abortion for some of you guys for some of you guys you could have moved on from this person for some of you guys um, for some of you guys, this person could have been at the single we got the warning if you moved on single this person for some of you somebody could have got pregnant by somebody else and it was at the single for some of you guys not for everyone um, for some of you, it could be a friend or a coworker that could want your partner for some of you guys. Uh, they could be saying slick, shady march for some of you guys, and they're really not your friend. We got owning business. Yeah, for some of you, this is a boss. For some of you, you could be somebody that owns your own business or something like that. Or somebody, or this person that you're messing with could be in the position where they own their own business. But, um, yeah, we're going to get a few more messages. What's going on with the situation? We got a main female. So some of y'all, this could be somebody very prominent, close to you. We got bad health. So for some of y'all, could be a main female around you. This is where the person could have some bad health or bad hygiene. We got adjudication. Um, For some of y'all, this person could have... Uh, for some of you guys, but the adjudication kind of bad health. For some of you guys, the person could be sick for some of you guys. For the bad health card, of course, shit. For some of you guys, this could be a main female guy. This person could be in a toxic relationship. This person, yeah, this person could be in a toxic relationship for some of you guys. This person could be arguing. This person could be acting like the relationship is perfect behind closed doors. They're arguing. 
for some of you guys. Or for some of you guys, this could be you. You could be in a relationship with someone and things were not healthy between you and this person. And you and this person could be arguing or can't see eye to eye. Or this person can't see eye to eye if they're dating somebody. Or for some of y'all, whoever this person, we have a false person. Yeah, for some of y'all, whoever this person, or for some of y'all, whoever this person is that uh wonder if you moved on. This could have been a female for some of you, not for everyone. And this is not a female. This could have been somebody that you could have been in a toxic relationship with. This is somebody that could have been a false person. You and this person could have been arguing a lot for some of you guys. We got expectation. This person um could have uh, but the false first person expectations could be the kind of person that could have first act like they were like this person could have been the kind of person where they come off like your dream person. They come off like like but the false person expectation. This would be kind of kind of with the courtship. This is the kind of person that acts like acts like they have good intentions act like if we did get the pure intentions card that came out earlier so this is somebody that act like they have pure intentions or act like they uh have good intentions when it comes towards you for some of y'all the main female and a courtship card and a false person for some of you guys uh this could be somebody around for some of y'all this is not uh for some of y'all if that's not the case for some of you guys uh if this is not the case for some of you guys i'm also seeing that there could be a main female around you or somebody that's prominent around you for some of you guys this could be somebody around the same age as you this person could be 31 or almost 31 or around 31 for some of you guys or for some of you guys uh this person could be very negative for some of you guys this person could be trying to uh get you and your person to get into argument for some of you guys or want this person to see you as a false person your person could be or some of you this person could be seeing if uh if 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 what they did work for some of you guys this is somebody trying to try to be trying to plant negative seed trying to see if it worked and then for some of you guys if that's not the case for some of you guys this is was a person that you were in a toxic relationship with and this was somebody that was very false and somebody that pretend to come off like this like this person like if you said that you wanted somebody that was loyal the person pretend like they're loyal it's like this person pretending to be what you were looking for we got the mature man. This person was very immature, though. This person couldn't even try to come off as mature, try to come off as somebody that that was very dependable. This person was immature as well, all alone. For some of you guys, this person could have um, changed. For some of you guys, like, this person could have just came off like very mature and all of a sudden, out of nowhere, they started acting immature. They started changing for some of you guys. For some of you guys, this person could have tried to give you a gift or to try to love, love bomb you or work their way back into, and work, work their way back into your um, energy. But we got the main meal card. So this person, uh, but the person could have, but the main male card being in reverse, this is somebody that just had hidden motives. This is somebody that had hidden intentions. This is somebody that could have came at, um, this could be somebody that even tried to come back in and try to act as if they changed, try to act as if, you know, they're different or holier or something like that. Yeah, but this person could have act like they changed, would have been working on themselves. With the official person for some of you guys. Clarify the official person. Who is it? Yeah, for some of you guys, you could have, uh, for some of you guys, you could have officially decided to walk away from this person. You and this person could have been in a relationship. This could have been a Scorpio. Yeah, for some of you guys, you could have decided to move on and hold back from this person. Yeah, and you decided you, for some of y'all, you or for some of y'all, y'all got the clarity that you needed on somebody, and you decided to hold back from them, and decided to uh because you got some kind of truth for some of you guys, or for some of you guys, you uh had some epiphany for some of you guys. For some of you guys, you could be holding back as well, want to start a new beginning. Yeah, for some of you guys, yeah, for some of you guys. But the ace of sports and the and the cuts for some of you guys, you can want to start a new beginning and love for love with somebody else. Okay, so for some of you guys, okay, so for some of you guys, we got the death card and the ace of cups and the tour source, and we got the uh so some of you guys you could have been dealing with somebody that could have kept you a limo for some of you guys. Because we got the uh, death card. And the death card could also talk about new beginnings, but it also talks about endings. So for some of you guys, you could have somebody could have ended something with you or somebody could have been holding back with you because they were trying to start something new with somebody else with the Ace of Cups and the Two of Swords. They were making the decision to start something new with somebody else with the Ace of Swords. And you could have found this out or you could have found that the reason why this person was holding back for you is because they was given to somebody else or, 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 or something like that. Or they had a decision between two love options because we got the two of swords and ace of cups so they had a um they had a, a, a option with 
two tr a choice in love with someone else somebody is this or they could they could have messed this person for some of you guys this could have been somebody new they could have met for some of you guys they could have met somebody at work not for everyone we got the knight of swords yeah the person could have decided to move towards somebody else Yeah, the person could have decided to move towards this, more move towards somebody else. Um, you know, um, this person could have been inconsistent with you. Or for some of you guys, this person was um for some of you guys, this person was being inconsistent, but they were trying to cover their track where you weren't noticing because we got the King of Swords, or did when we got the Knight of Wands. So this person could have been. This person could have been trying to be, uh, the person could have been being a player or something like that, but trying to be smart or a body. Yeah, like this person was trying to keep it on the low that they were trying to go towards somebody else or they was trying to have a new beginning with somebody else or they had an option between you and someone else and they were trying to play it or try to play you, trying to keep it, keep it on low, trying to be like very logical about it with the King of Swords. Yeah, with the Eight of Swords. Yeah, this person's trying to keep you. Yeah, the person's trying to keep you. Uh, keep you stuck or trying to keep you not seeing the truth. Yeah, but the four cups, like this person could try to get the the four cups, like this person would with the four cups. The four cups is also like uh also like to me it's like giving to giving to someone as well. But would it be in reverse in the eight of swords? It's like this person could have tried to give to you. Uh, just to keep you stuck like this person was like breadcrumbing you giving you enough just just enough for you not to leave yeah the sun card yeah but yeah with the sun card it's like the eight of color it was, yeah this person was giving you enough not to leave but you still weren't happy like you weren't satisfied for some of you guys you, like you weren't content you started noticing that this person was breadcrumbing you or you just could have felt stuck with this person. You could have felt like you know it was being hurt. You know, you could have felt like things were changed between this person. You things were no longer the same. You could have stopped over to thinking about it for some of you guys. Like you could have been overthinking and you just completely stopped overthinking about it. It got to a point where you just had to it's like this person just pushed you to the point where you had to, yeah. Like with the strong card, this person just pushed you to the point. This could be a Leo for some of you guys. But the person could have just pushed you to the uh, we got Leo twice for some of you guys. The person could have just pushed you to the point where you just feel like you need to just completely walk away or completely just, you know, have to you for some of you guys you have to literally like have mind over matter when it comes to this person. Like you literally had to take your heart out of it and it could have hurt it a lot for some of you guys, but you literally had to take your heart out of it because you knew this person wasn't good for you. Yeah, the star card. Yeah, for some of you guys, you could have been when it came in reverse, though. For some of you guys, you with the strength card, you could have been trying to be very hopeful that this will work out. You could be trying to get this person the benefit of the doubt, but this person still let you down with the seven of pentacles because it's all seven of pentacles. I also have to talk about delays. It says this person still let you down, though. We got the seven of swords. Yeah, this person was still being sneaky, this person still being dishonest. Still, you know, had things up their sleeves, trying to keep, still trying to keep, trying to keep you in the dark with. Person came in, could have told you that they changed for some of you guys, and they didn't. Yeah, but the three pendulum guys, this person was still working. Up. Yeah, for some of you guys, this person was still working on things. Yeah, for some of you guys, this person was still working on things with other people. Or the person, yeah, the person could have just been working to get their needs met for some of you guys. Only worrying about themselves because the Nine of Cups can also just be somebody that's very content by themselves. We got the Three of Pentacles as well. So the person could have been very, very content working um, by themselves or, you know, doing things for themselves that uh, satisfy them. They was they um could have been given to this person as well, given this to this person financially. Working with this person for some of you guys, they could have worked with this person for some of you guys. Yeah, they could. They, yeah, for some of you guys, they worked with this person. This was a coworker, but if you find that or or somebody that at their job, or this could be somebody at your job for some of you guys. 
But um, yeah, if you find this video really resonate with you, please hit the like button, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell for next time. Peace, love, and light, beautiful, bigger, and bolder. Bye. Hello, welcome to my channel, Sophie Gift the Pop. So if you find this reading really resonate with you, please hit the like button, please comment down below, please subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell so you never miss out on any of my uploads. If you find this reading really resonate with you, check out my other readers, they may resonate with you as well. Also, if you're inquiring about a personal reading, everything is listed down below in the description box. I already said you should have the cards and chip it over to the desk. We're going to hop right into it. Thank you so much for liking, commenting, and subscribing. What is going on with your current situation? We're going to look into your current situation. What's going on with your current situation? Please take what resonate. I'm going to be throwing out all types of situations. It's not going to resonate for everyone because I'm connected with so many people. Okay. What's going on with my power two current situation? What's going on with my power two current situation? We got manifesting. So some of you guys, somebody could be manifesting for you. For some of you guys, somebody wants another chance with you. Or somebody could be manifesting another chance with you. Manifesting to get back in your good grace for some of you guys. Somebody could be manifesting and think for you two to come back together. Um, for some of you guys, this person could was supposed to show up for you. For some of you guys, you and the person could have supposed to go out. You heard the person could, was supposed to go to an event or something. Maybe this event got canceled for some of you guys. And the person manifested another opportunity. For some of you guys, this could have been a date. And the person had to cancel. And now this person manifested another date or another chance. For some of you guys, this could be somebody that you owe money to. For some of you guys, or someone owes you money for some of you guys. Yeah, for some of you, yeah, for some of you guys, somebody pulled a show somewhere, but they didn't show because they knew you were gonna beat it because they owe you some money. For some of you guys, for some of you guys, we got pretending they don't want like you. So for some of you guys, somebody could be pretending like they don't like you or they don't want you. For some of you guys, they could be pretending like they don't want to be with you, but they're manifesting you. We got play nice, nasty, evil behind closed doors. And some of you guys, somebody could be very nasty, evil behind closed doors. Somebody could like to play dirty. This is gonna be the kind of person that's act nice, act sweet. Or the person could um, be somebody that comes off as very unproblematic, but three behind closed door, they throw rocks and hide their hands. We got hardcore addiction. For some of you guys, this person could be into drugs or hardcore addictions. You know, it could be like sex addictions. It could be uh, meth or cocaine, hardcore stuff like that. For some of you guys, I'm not like, talking about marijuana. I'm talking about hardcore stuff. Alcoholic for some of you guys. For some of you guys, we got shade, shady jokes, but I don't like it. So for some of you guys, this would be somebody around you that constantly throwing shady jokes around you for some of you guys but this person really doesn't like you this person just pretends that they do for some of you guys for some of you guys this person could have some kind of addiction for some of you guys whoever this person is this is this kind of person that's very evil for some of you guys be somebody that owe you money for some of you guys or this person owes somebody money for some of you guys whoever this person is that that throwing shady remarks to you as a joke this is somebody that's very mean very evil we got to wonder if you moved on. For some of you, the person that's manifested for some of you guys is wondering if you moved on. For some of you, this is somebody that pretended like they like you and didn't want you. For some of you guys, and they could have missed the opportunity with you. Now they're watching and wondering if you moved on. For some of you guys, for some of you guys, this person could have thought you were going to chase them for some of you guys and you did it. For some of you guys, um... For some of you guys, you for some of you guys, not for all, but some of you guys, you could have dated someone that was trying to use you as a placeholder. Somebody that was just trying to use you until they find a person that they really wanted to be with. For some of you guys, just somebody that's very evil. This person could have had malicious attention for some of you guys. This is, this is somebody that could be had. This person will have hardcore addiction. This person could have mental issues for some of you guys or something like that. Uh, whoever this person is, this would be the kind of person that uh try to use you as a placeholder, try to stay with you or keep you until they find the one that they wanted. This could have been somebody that was manifesting other people. Like this would be the kind of person where it's like they will sit there. This was the kind of person that will sit there pile to. This is. The, some of you guys probably too, this is the kind of person that will sit there and they'll use you or use people as a placeholder to get to 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 the things that they really want. Whether it's using you as a friend or to get to the real girlfriends they want or whether it's a lover, you know, being your lover to get to the uh, friends that they um, get to the lovers that they really want. For some of you guys, this lover that's using you as a placeholder, I was using you as a placeholder. They could have been manifesting someone else. They could have been manifesting others. For some of you guys, the person could pretend like they didn't like someone when they did. Or for some of you guys, if whoever this lover was, they could have been saying shady jokes to you. Now, that's not going to resonate with some of you guys, but it's going to resonate with some. We got Want Your Partner. Some of you guys go watch Power One because there may be some messages in there for some of you guys. We got Want Your Partner. For some some of you guys, there could be somebody around you that can want your partner. They can be manifesting your partner for some of you guys. 
You know, we got this man that's very evil as well behind closed door. They do things, malicious people, for, uh, do malicious things to other people for to get a thrill out of it. We got telling you, telling you the story, but leaving out important details. So for some of y'all, you came with somebody that could have told you something. They was leaving out important details for some of you guys, and they wasn't telling you everything because so, they didn't want you. To, they was trying. They wanted you to be biased on purpose for some of you guys. It's like this person didn't want you to have an option to be diplomatic to see both sides of the situation. This person left things out on purpose so you could see their side. That's a specific mention for someone. For some of you guys, this could be some of you guys. This could be a boss for some of you guys, or for some of you guys. Of if this is not your a boss for some of you guys, this is somebody that can be a boss, or you can be a boss for some of you guys. For some of you guys, a boss could owe you money. For some of you guys, we got one of you wanted you to compete. For some of you guys, a boss could wanted you to compete for money. For some of you guys at a job, a boss could wanted you to compete for opportunity. For some of you guys, for some of you guys, you can have a boss that like to say shady remarks to you or, or try to say shady jokes. You can have a boss that could be evil behind closed doors. For some of you guys, you can even have a boss that was trying to use you as a placeholder until they find somebody else to replace you. For some of you guys. Some of you guys, this boss could be wondering if you've uh moved on or something like that, or found another job, or wonder if you find another job for some of you guys. That's going to resonate for a couple. For some of you guys, we got a lover jealous of you. So again, for some of you guys, you could have had like some kind of lover that was jealous of you. This person was using you as a placeholder, or you know, this person could be keeping you for finances so they make the money that they wanted to make to leave you. It could have been anything, placeholder for anything for some of you guys. We got jealous as fuck. Some of you guys, so this is some of you guys. Some, you can have somebody around you that's jealous of you as well. We got head and half head and motives. Somebody's a jealous around you, half head and motives. For some of you guys, this person around you. For some of you guys that want your partner, this is somebody that's jealous as fuck over you. This is somebody that has hidden motives. This partner that's manifesting your partner. This is somebody that pretend that they don't like your partner when they do. For some of you guys, they try to pretend when you're not around or when they're around. For some of you guys, this somebody that say shady little jokes or remarks. It's the kind of person that play nice. They play like, play like they like you when they really don't. For some of you guys, I'm gonna get some more messages on who this person could be we got caught up so for some of you guys this person you could have caught this person or you could have know who this person is for some of you guys for some of you guys you could have caught up this partner for some of you guys that you was messing with this jealous partner you could have caught this partner up for some of you guys you could have realized this person was jealous of you or had some kind of hidden motives against you for some of you guys or some of you guys you could have found, found out that this boss or somebody around you had hidden motives or you could have caught them up we have your family, friends, always in our bases. So for some of you guys, this person could uh, tell your their family. If, if, yeah, for some of you guys, this person could be in your business. For some of you guys, they or your family and friends could be in y'all business. For some of you guys, or this person could like to bring their family and friends in y'all business. For some of you guys, and for some of you guys, you could outgrew this person. For some of you guys. We got unloyed because I'm so sinner. I only give a fuck about myself. So for some of you guys, you could have outgrew this person because this person is just somebody that's very selfish. Just somebody that only worries about them, only care about, you know, things that happen on their turn. They only care about themselves. We got steal. So some of you guys, this could be a thief for some of you guys. Or some of you guys, somebody's trying to steal your partner. The person could be obsessed with you. For some of you guys, you can have somebody that's obsessed with you and they're constantly manifesting you for some of you guys. For some of you guys, again, it's probably that you could have you probably going to date with and y'all end up not going on a date for some of you guys and they can want another opportunity with you. For some of y'all, we got friends, they're not just a friend. So for some of you guys, you could have had somebody around you that could be friends with someone and they keep telling you that they're just a friend, but they're really not. It's more than just a friend. They just keep telling you that it's just a friend. Or this is somebody in the past that could have told you that somebody was just a friend and you caught them up. We got can't get you off my mind. Yeah, for some of you guys, somebody can't get you off their mind. For some of you guys, somebody's obsessed with you. They keep thinking about you. We got have me hiding feelings for you. So somebody around you is manifesting you. They have hidden feelings from you. For some of you guys, you can have a friend that have hidden feelings for you as well. They they like you. For some of you guys, they have hidden feelings for you. They're obsessed with you. They can't get you off their mind. We got here for the money. So for some of you guys, again, we got placeholder right here. So some of you guys, somebody could have been keeping you or staying with you until they got their stuff together. And when they decided to get their stuff together, they're going to just go off with someone else or go off and leave you on the dust for some of you guys. This could have been something you was dealing with in the past or something that you're currently dealing with. 
um for some of you guys you could have been messing with somebody that still somebody for some of you guys somebody could still mess mess around with their child's mother their child's father but they're obsessed with you they can't get you off their mind but they're still tied to their to, to their child's mother or father for some of you guys for some of you guys, this person could have told you that they was done with this child's mother or this, or their baby mama or their baby daddy, but they really wasn't over with them for some of you guys. For some of you guys, this could be somebody's baby mom or baby dad that's jealous of you for some of you guys. Uh, for some of you guys, they could feel like you stole their the, their partner from the, from them for some of you guys. Uh, for some of you guys, uh, if the placeholder owe money, I wonder if this person could be uh staying with this person due to child support or due to some kind of finance for some of you guys. And this person with a play knife for some of you guys, the person could be playing knife, being trying to at play knife with this baby mom or baby dad. Not for everyone. But for some of you guys, this person still mess around with them either either or go. They still mess around with this person. They still be, you know, mess around with this person. You know, they say they done, but they really not. This person could be there for the money for some of you guys. They still mess around with this person for the money. Or this person that's around could be messing around with them for the money. This could be somebody that's an alcoholic. Uh, we got I love you from you guys. This could be somebody that you was in love with at one point in time. Or this could be somebody that told you that they loved you. We got damaged your belongings. Some of you guys, this person's belongings could have got damaged. Or somebody could have damaged your belongings for some of you guys. This person could have been drunk and damaged your belongings. We got an argument. Some of you guys, you could have gotten into with somebody and they could have uh, damaged your stuff or did something to your stuff. But this person could have gotten into with somebody and they damaged their belongings. We got walked away from good. For some of you guys, they could have walked away from good after this person damaged their belongings. Or somebody that messed with your stuff, you could have decided to completely walk away from them once they like destroyed your things. What's going on with my pile 2 current situation? What's going on with my pile 2 current situation? Yeah, great fortune. So you got some great fortune coming. You got some blessings coming in for you. For some of you guys, you got some unexpected income for some of you guys. For some of you guys, you could be getting married for some of you guys. Or you're going to get some unexpected money for some of you guys. It could be like, uh, you know how uh somebody can really unexpectedly give you some money for the guy. Um, if you're married for some of you guys, it could be like somebody that you're in a... Or some of you guys, it could be somebody that's married that could want to give you some unexpected money for some of you guys. They want to help you out. Or for some of you guys, this person this could be your um significant other, your partner for some of you guys. So for some of you guys, somebody could have thought they were gonna be going somewhere nice for their honeymoon for some of you guys, or for some of you guys, somebody's gonna uh end up going somewhere nice for their honeymoon is gonna be unexpected. Maybe they thought they couldn't afford it or they well, thought they weren't gonna be able to afford it, but they're gonna afford something nice. That's not for everyone, but it's gonna be for a couple people. We got the wealthy man. So some of you guys you could be marrying to the, some money for some of you guys. For some of you guys you could be marrying to some money or your wedding could cost some money. It could be uh out of state or people may have to travel or spend money to come to your wedding. It could be out of the state for some of you guys. Not for everyone. What's a mature woman? What's a mature woman? So somebody could be stuck in a marriage due to some kind of money or some financial situation for some of you guys. Or somebody could not want somebody to move on for some of you guys with adjudication in, in reverse. For some of you guys, somebody could not want somebody to move on for them due to finance. Somebody could want to keep somebody because of their money. But the courtship wanted to come out in reverse, and the, and the, and the spirit wanted to come out. So for some of you guys, this person could be in an unhappy marriage, or this person could be in an unhappy relationship, but this person is trying to keep them stud due to finances for some of you guys. We got poverty, yeah, due to finances. This person, is trying, this person does not have any money to take care of themselves, so they're trying to stay with this person. They could be asking this person for money for some of you guys. Yeah, we got the main male in high honor for some of you guys, but this but this main male can feel like this person is not privileged or this person is the kind of person that's not privileged or whatever. So it's like this person, it's like the person could have damaged their belongings for some of you guys. This person could be the kind of person that just acts unprivileged. Yeah, for some of you guys, they could have uh, 
want to end this relationship with this person for some of you guys because they feel like this person is not they could feel like this person is not good enough for them for some of you guys for some of you guys this person could be texting this man for some of you guys the person could be texting this person trying to work things out with this person but this person could not want to work things out with them and want to completely close this cycle yeah the mature man a mature man wants to completely uh, older man wants to completely close this cycle yeah, this person no longer want a relationship with this person. This person no longer loves this person. We got the courtship in reverse and the lovers in reverse. This person no longer wants a relationship with whoever this is. This mature man. We got the lovers and the child for some of you guys. So for some of you guys, this person could have uh, gotten, a, I won't say an abortion for some of you guys. And this mature man could have found out or this main male could have found out for some of you guys. Or for some of you guys, if that's not the case, for some of you guys, this person could have a kid with this person, but they don't want to be in a relationship with this person. They can have kids together, but this person don't want to be with this person. The toil and labor year, for some of you guys, this person doesn't want to work things out, or they could just want to work on things, or just want to work and take care of their kid. But the distant horizon, so yeah, this person could, this person could not want to be with them, but they could want to, or for some of you guys, this person could be working on, this person could be in a relationship that they don't want to be in, but working on it, or working completely in relationship to, for their kid. And it is the horizon in reverse to this person, that's why this person is feeling stuck. Yeah, stuck or by the main female. This person is being stuck by a main female, somebody that is keeping them stuck. Or this person could be stuck and they could be worried about a main female. Like this person could be this person could be stuck with someone else that they don't want to be with due to kids, but they're worried about somebody else. They're thinking about somebody else. This could be somebody that's obsessed over you, they're thinking about you. We got the thief card. This person could be a, um, a this person could be concerned, worrying if somebody is taking you from them and wondering if you met somebody else. If you're talking to somebody new. Yeah, with the bad health, this person could wonder if you talk to somebody better than them, somebody that can that can give you what you want. pathway yeah this person want to know the person want to know if you find somebody that, that that's destined that you destined to be with or for some of you guys this person could feel like whoever this person is they're not destined to be with this main main female because the pathway came is in reverse so they could feel like they're or for some of you guys this main female could be feeling like you're going to steal this person away from them for some of you guys and the person can be worried for some of you guys but this main female is not somebody that, it's like a karmic for some of you guys yeah, for some of you guys, this person can have a family with this person. This is a karmic. They can live with this person. For some of you guys, this person could have uh, thought about moving out for some of you guys. Or this person could have thought about getting a new job. This person could have thought about getting a new job, applying for a new job. For some of you guys, this person want to know if you found somebody that has a better job than them, somebody that can afford to give you nicer things since you're single. Yeah, with the message of the concern card, this person could want to text you or reach out to you. About some money. But we got the gift from reverse. So the person could want to reach out to you about. Uh, the person could just want to reach out to you. Saying that they want to give you something. But it may not be true. They just want to see if you were to text back. Or try to get you to text back. Or somebody could have thought they were going to get some money about some. That somebody could have thought they're gonna get some some money for their bond or something or for some kind of release and they're not. You have the official person in reverse. This person could have thought they were gonna be free. We got the false person in the house. Yeah, for some of you guys, this person could be feeling trapped with this whoever this person that they're with living with. They could be feeling trapped with them for some of you guys. But if you find this reading resonates with you, please hit the like. Well, hold on, let me get a couple more messages. For some of you guys, because everybody not having that situation. Big cat's a seven wild, so you could be feeling defensive towards somebody, or somebody could be feeling defensive towards you. 
You could be feeling defensive towards this person because you feel like this person is not. You could feel like this person is not us. Uh, you could feel like you could be feeling defensive towards this person because you feel like this person uh, is somebody that does not have any gratitude. You could feel like this person is not thankful. So you could be being defensive towards that. You you could be yeah. You could be feeling guarded because you could feel like somebody's not thankful. You feel like somebody is not 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 appreciated appreciate appreciate you for some of you guys. Yeah, for some of you guys, you can feel like this person is impatient. Yeah, you feel like the person uh is not balanced. The person could just pretend like they just can't wait or Yeah, for some of you guys, the person you some of you guys could be Sagittarius. For some of you guys, the person you could feel like for some of you guys, you could feel like this person is given to other people. For some of you guys, you'll be feeling defensive towards somebody because they could have been given to other people and you decided to move on. You decided to heal. But you still think about this connection time to time. This could be somebody that you already dated. Things could have took off really quick with you and this person. Things could have moved fast with you and this person. I'm just probably gonna be this person knew all the right words to say to you for some of you guys. You have the four wands, yeah. Things could have took off with you and this person fairly quickly. This person finds it to be very attractive. This person wanted to have a new beginning with you or have a new start with you in love. They could want to have a new passion to start with you in love. The person could want to take a new beginning towards you or a leap of faith towards you. For a new beginning with the ace of swords person want to tell you that they want us to stay, have a new beginning with you the person could want to ask you about on a date for some of you guys with the ace of pentacles where they can want to invest and if for some of you guys with the eight of cups for some of you guys that this person disappointed you in the past it's like this person does not want to disappoint you now we have the five of pentacles this person was having money issues with some of you guys they could want to uh come back when they had their money together with the three of wands with the five of pentacles or they could be waiting to get their money together so they could come towards you with a better attitude. Yeah, with the Knight of Wands, the person could be very uh, passionate about you. Knight of Pentacles, because the person could want to come in for a passion or offer for some of you guys. The person want to come in for a passion or offer uh, to get things going with you in a stable direction. Like this person want to come in. They passionate about this new offer that they want to give you the Knight of Pentacles because they want to move slow. Or the person could be like, oh, I just want to be friends. Or the person could just want to move slow with you. But this person is definitely feeling you. But this person just want to make sure things go playing with you, go right between you. They don't want things to go. You know, the Ten of Pentacles, this person wants um, wants long term with you. So this person wants things to go right. So this person, they're like, they don't want to mess anything up. Yeah, this person wants to work on things with you with the three of pentacles. This person wants to work on making you happy. This person wants to make you happy. Work on fixing things with you. The paid person is trying to be smart as well. The person is trying to impress you when they come back. We got the emperor. This could be an Aries. This person wants to impress you when they come back as well. Or the person wants to make sure you see them in a in a more uh a more uh, dependable light. Yeah, the death card, this person does not want things to be over. So this person wants you to see them in a new in a new light. They don't want things to completely be over. The person does not want to argue with you, the Queen of Swords in reverse. With the Queen of Wands, the person just wants to be bold. The person could want to like tell you how they feel directly, but they don't want to argue. They don't want to, want to come off as harsh. The person could want to tell you that they uh learn some kind of lesson or they or they like yeah, they learn some kind of lesson and, and they're missing you. With the five of cups this person is grieving you this person is going to tell you that they want a new pattern to start with you they don't want to close this cycle out page of pentacles this person wants to offer you something stable this person want to person who want to offer you something stable or or stable in the beginning like yeah unexpected yeah person want to offer you a new beginning or the person going to be wanting to offer you a new beginning unexpectedly 
the five of wands they hope with the five of wands they hope it's not yeah if they hope it's not uh or the two of, with the two of wands in reverse they hope that they hope that you say yeah or they, or they hope that you know you don't reject them i hope that it's easy like this person is like this person they just want to come in and want things to be smooth like this person i'm just getting this energy beside this person just like you know what i know i did wrong but i'm here now i want to fix this just give me a chance just hear me out this is this person. But if you find this reading resonate with you guys, this is the other message I was getting. Okay, so that they may re resonate for all the other ones. If you find this reading resonate with you, please hit the like button, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell. Till next time, peace, love, and light. Beautiful, big, and both there. Bye.